I found no more logs from Dr. Essie, but I have used her algorithm to crack the data core of the Vex conceptual mind. That's the doodad we got from the Black Garden, right? Indeed. The data within contained the Vex's blueprints for their artificial veil, the Black Heart. It all but proved Dr. Essie's theory. Dr. Essie theorized that the paracausal energy of the Traveler operated on a quantum wavelength parallel to Electron. Um... Magnet? In simpler terms, the Traveler's power runs parallel to the forces of nature. Gravity, magnetism, sound, light. The Veil does this too. It is synchronized with the Traveler. Wherever the Traveler came from, the Veil may have as well. But what the Vex made, while connected to the Traveler, was inherently flawed. It did not create the link the Witness desired. Instead, it weakened the Traveler, created static in the flow of their cosmic forces. But it did reveal one intriguing possibility. That at one time, they may have been united. Part of a whole. <laughs> so, wait. Does this mean the light and darkness were the same ones? One force. Dr. Essie believed so. I am not as convinced. But it is a theory. One many scholars will explore once this data is shared. But this data allowed me to calculate the telemetry of the beam the veil fired at the Traveler. When the witness linked to the veil through a ghost, it created a faster-than-light connection of darkness to the Traveler's light. A bridge to the Traveler's consciousness, if it has one. But the beam did not stop at the Traveler, rather a point inside of it. Inside? Wait, what's inside the Traveler? No one knows. But if the data I've been able to extrapolate here is correct, that is where the witness is now, inside the Traveler. It may be the reason why the Traveler has gone dormant, its attention directed inward, what the true threat is. But I am speculating. There is more I need to study, but I fear it will take a substantially longer amount of time. How long do you need? Months. If we have that long left, that is. Until then, I suppose. <laughs>